all right fellas in this video we will see how to install bcc plugin in after effects so first of all you need to navigate to borisfx.com this is the official website you need to click on download free trial or you can purchase the license that you can subscribe to for the annual subscription or the monthly subscription once you are done you will be provided with the boris fx compressed file you need to right click on this file and once you're done you need to navigate to open with and you need to select winrar so once you're right inside you will see the installer here you need to click on this installer and you need to click on extract to and you need to specify the path where you want to extract this installer right now i'm gonna do this for the desktop and i will click on ok so as you can see i have the installer here that is extracted from the zipped file and i will double click on this i will grant all permissions if required and i will click on yes it will start downloading the boris continuum complete bcc plugin for after effects it will ask you for the language you can click on this drop down and select your preferred language i will go with english and i will click on ok now you need to accept all the terms and conditions and you need to click on next you need to specify the path where you want to install this file i will keep it as default and i will click on next again next if you want to create a shortcut on the desktop you can click this option and you can click on next now you are ready to install the boris fx hub and we will install the bcc plugin right inside that so you need to click on install now make sure launch boris fx hub is selected and you need to click on finish and now you need to go with continue with google to create your account or you can also sign up with your email address password and confirm password i'm gonna go with continue with google i will select my account to authenticate with the borisfx.com once you have authenticated the borisfx with your gmail account you will need to navigate back to your borisfx hub and you need to provide some information about yourself now you are successfully logged in into the boris fx hub and now you can explore their products that you have we are concerned with the continuum so i am gonna click on install and for now i am gonna go with install a free watermark trial of the continuum and i will click on install if you have uh, purchased this continuum and if you have a license key or activation key you can click on this and you can enter the activation key code and then we are good to go to click on install now it will ask whether you want to install this for uh, after effects or premiere pro or DaVinci Resolve or Vegas Pro or this is for the Avid Media Composer. We are concerned with the Adobe After Effects and Premiere Pro so I will select this option and I will click on install. So right now it will start downloading the continuum for my Adobe After Effects and Adobe Premiere Pro. Alright fellas so as you can see we have the success message and the BCC plugin has been successfully installed. So now you need to click on continue. And let us go right inside the After Effects to check whether it is properly installed or not. Alright fella, so as you can see we are right inside the After Effects. And first of all let us create a new composition so that we can test this BCC plugin. I will click on the new composition and I will keep the composition settings as default. And I will click on OK. Once you are done make sure you are in the project settings in the left side of the After Effects. And let us create a text layer so that we can test whether BCC plugin is working or not. So I will for that I will go to the composition and I will right click here and I will go to the new and I will click on text. Alright fellas, so then then you need to go to the window and you need to select the effects and presets this one and you need to click on this once you do so you will see the effects and presets tab in the right side of the after effects or the position may vary but you will see the effects and presets search for bcc now you will see all the bcc plugins that are available in your after effects that you can use and it shows that your bcc plugin has been successfully installed into your after effects so right now i'm gonna test with bcc blur dissolve and for that i will click on this text layer and i will double click on the bcc blur dissolve so as you can see i have successfully installed the bcc plugin right inside the after effects and it is working perfectly and you can see the cross sign in the center of the window it means that this is a free trial you need to pay for that in order to remove the cross sign from your window i hope you like this video and you must have followed along to successfully install the bcc plugin in the after effects that's it i hope you like this video if you have any questions you can comment down below i will try my best to respond to you as soon as possible thank you so much for watching this video and have a nice day